everybody and welcome to this amazing game of Cupid vs. Mercury. I'm gonna do something crazy today. Yay! <laughs> um, let's see, 15 health power. Blue stone gives me 15 physical power. Now. Okay, we're definitely going that. We're gonna get the recommended of consumable and um, Health or mana? Two. One, two. Perfect. Oh, me too, kiddo. Me too. Now, the one thing I've never done is pushed a lane before my opponent got to lane. And the reason I say that I've never done that is because, well, I've never done that. So, the objective of this play is to ignore your buff and to in fact push as hard and fast as you can so by the time they come to lane um, they lose gold but he already got his buff lost gold lost gold see his experience doesn't matter too much for me and I'm gonna pressure him out of lane he's gonna have to back okay see and that's why I got health potions Ooh, I'm hurting him. So I got the health potions. I'm gonna heal myself, cause this is freaking broke as hell. Uh oh. So he's gonna come back level four, and I'm just gonna keep pressuring as hard as I can, keeping my health and mana as high as I can. That way, oh, this is just so mean. And I've already got my ult. I'm gonna heal myself again. And Bluestone's just gonna keep my mana up. And I'm just gonna shut him out of as much gold as possible. And that's the whole point. Just shut him out of gold. There we go. There we go. He's hitting me hard, as hard as he can. So I'm gonna go ahead and heal whatever damage he lays on me. And then I'll pressure him to lose gold. Alright, he can ult back to lane. But I'm not going back till I can afford a Devil's Gauntlets, because there's no point. Well, this is why I have potions. Alright, so he's got to get out again, and it's just going to kill his... It's going to kill his gold. He doesn't get gold unless, you know, he can kill him before the tower. Next wave, I can finally get, um... I can finally go get some... Ooh... Uh oh, I shouldn't have shot that one. Alright, so I can get Devos and that's what I'm gonna go grab real quick. And I just need crits and Devos and Hasten. This will increase my power. Grab a few more of these, two more of those. And again, return to lane. Now he's gonna get experience from jungle but I'm gonna get gold from the center and gold is heavily important right now he's gonna beat me in experience I'm gonna beat him in gold and I never knew this was like the most legit strategy ever till recently and it being the most legit strategy ever it's pretty friggin brutal Ooh. Ow. see that's good hits but I'm already stacking a Devourer's Gauntlet. He's dead. <laughs> that sucked. So again, I, it's not about my buffs. It, for the first time ever, as a Cupid, I'm focusing only on taking the center. His ult is down. 
and I got potions to use, so I need to keep my health higher. And, you know, like I said, as long as he keeps missing. Ow. So I'll just keep healing. It's not like he hurts me all that much. Ooh, I missed. Owie. But that's a fair clear. Oh, he wants to play. All right, we'll play. I do not mind. Do not mind. It's just a kind of slow game, but it's all about pressuring him so he doesn't get any gold. Now I'm going to go get boots. Oh, he's already getting armor, so I'm going to just go ahead and rush Executioner because there's no need for me to, you know, get boots if he's not getting boots. He'll be slightly faster than me, but again, objectively, it would be better if I just made sure I took out um, his armor. Made, make that armor useless, in a sense. Yeah, he's going to probably take another buff, I'm not sure. Or come around, one or the other, I can't tell. But one thing I'm gonna definitely make sure I do is make sure that my mana consumption is as minimal as possible. I'm gonna keep that mercury back. Ooh. Jerk. Okay, you wanna dance? Give me nine seconds, buddy. Give me nine seconds. Alright, I'm just actually gonna back. I got myself in a bad spot. Get some boots. Why don't I? But I definitely do not want. Ooh, we got Mid Guardian right off the bat, so I'm definitely going hasten as soon as I get boots. He can go for that, that's fine. Again, buffs aren't a huge thing for me. Experience wise, I'm keeping up enough not to care. Just gotta watch for the alt from that side. He could still come in from an alt, so I'm gonna hug this side, that way I can't get ulted. Yep, that's one tire down. I haven't even gone for a buff yet. Feeling pretty good about that though, to be honest. Ooh, he stoles it. Okay, your alt doesn't work like that, buddy. Sorry to say. Ow. There we go. Escaped fairly well, I might add. Ah, uh, but I gotta stay around now. He's dead. Oh, he got teamed up by both Phoenix and, um, well, that was kind of brutal for him. I'm going to go ahead and start getting Rage, that way I can um, deal more damage to him. I won't need Hasten yet. He's just now getting Devourer's Gauntlets. I am now faster than him uh, because of, well, Boots. And I'll be even faster with the Hasten. I don't that hit the middle one, dang it, dang it. I can't. 
Friggin' hit him. Thank you for clearing that. Oh, these heals are nasty and they're still level 1. How nasty is that? Is he really? Oh, he is. Yep. Nope. Ooh. He's running for it though. I'm gonna heal before I move on. And then I'll take his purple. Because if he wants it so bad, he's gotta come fight me for it. Definitely want my alt up some more. Oh, snaps. He took it. And faster. I can get a dash in a second here. Until I can get a hasten, it's really not worth it chasing him around. Oh, lucky. So lucky on that one. Well, I'll go get my purple buff for fresh it. I can get rage. And then we're going to go ahead and get Fatalis next so I can keep up with him. Because now he's got boots and now he can actually outrun me. But he won't be able to run, run me if I have a hasten. He's just not as powerful as he used to be. Man, I haven't even gotten armor yet, man. I haven't even gotten armor yet. Damn, so look at that. One hit. He's going around. Ah, oh, he's out. He's gonna out back. Oh, he kind of wants his blue. Wish I had hasten. Uh oh. <laughs> I actually dashed, but because I damn, because I was stuck. All right, all right, all right. We're gonna get mid guardian as well. I don't think he's got any pen, so armor is going to screw him. Does he get my tower for that? I think he can, actually. No. No, actually, yeah, it does look like he's going to get it. Oh, no. Nope, nope, nope. He's not going to get it. He's going to stay in lane, though, for sure. I've got a little bit of armor to keep me around. i take the big minion out. Jeez, it defends itself way too well. Oh, I guess I just, I'm not caring about this match too much when I really should. Guess I'll go get Sprint next. Got power. Could get another piece of my armor. Now I'll get Sprint. Sprint's very important in this match if I'm going to keep up with him, because he's got slows on mid-guardian. And I'm also going to get a mid-guardian, so we'll see how this fares for him. Because now he's getting crits where I have already got pen. I already know it's over here. What is he going for that? Oh, his blue buff. Why would you go for blue? You missed me. Actually, I'm going back. I can get some armor. Yep, that'll help me survive even more. Even though he's going for more crits. Drop the damage by a hefty chunk. Then my last item will be a hasten, so I can stay away from him.
he's gonna go for a uh, major look which will potentially kill me but I'm gonna life steal like a boss Oh no. Got him. Yeah, he's not so strong because I've got armor. You got Shield of the Underworld? I mean, I can get the same thing too. I don't need beads anymore. He's coming back in nine, I think, maybe. If I'm lucky, in five seconds I can actually take his stuff. I think our ults are both down, so fully healed practically. All right, I'm out. Can't fight this. Not until I get Myth Guardian. Then I'll sell this to start building a Hasten, and I'll probably swap out Executioner for. Um, I'll swap out execution for Titan's Bane to deal more flat damage without relying on basic attacks against him. Which he doesn't have beads, so as long as I've got this little bomb passive of mine, which is heart bomb, uh, it also increases, you know, mes duration and such. All very important. I'll be able to kill him pretty quick. Plus, he's got like no attack speed. my heart bomb up. Ooh. Ooh, that was not good. Yeah, Cupid, you tell him. Ow. That freaking hurt. But I got the passive and then we're gonna save up for sh might as well get full sprint and then save up for Shield of the Underworld and then we'll get a pass above, blah blah blah. All those fancy changes. Oh, he's sticking around. He went down that other path. I wonder why. Both our alts down? I think so. Where'd he go? Oh, he backed! So I get red. Sweet! I'll take it. I will take red. Happily take red. I like how he's gotta run every time. It's great. It's like the best feeling in the world when a Mercury is afraid of a Cupid. Missed. Alright, well, now I get to play the game of doges it's very unfortunate for him he's not going to be able to life steal all that well but he's going to keep me at bay with major luck he's going to try oh he's out of purple damn that sucks Uh-oh, without him backing? This is so bad for him. This is so very bad for him. He's done. He's done. That was it. But I can't die yet. I've got another wave minions on its way. So, um, the whole reason I pick Cupid and you can see Mercury in a game is because I changed my bands because I realized season two is very different like the overpowered gods changed hyper carries are no longer a thing because movement speed is no longer a thing if you ha relied on a character with movement speed it doesn't work anymore because both witchblade and um, the speed buff are gone 
So essentially, what has happened is characters with that kind of movement speed, like, play completely trash, no good, yada yada. I'm gonna swap this for Titans. I'm gonna get Shield of the Underworld, and then a Power Potion. All items consumable. That. Well, he's pushing hard, fighting by himself. He's a strong cookie. Ah, that was it. That was it. The <laughs> fire minions finished him. Holy crap! Um, I feel bad for Hup. He he wasn't in he. I was on a losing streak, so he had to fight me in master as a master. But you know, Mercury just isn't what he used to be. He's not overpowered anymore. So Cupid, on the other hand, I love all hunters and jowls. Thank you everybody for watching, like, comment, subscribe, and as always, good game!